I'm about to uh, start uh, my stream on Twitch, but before I do that, I'm gonna leave this uh, little entry for Reddit. Ben Feingold, a U.S. Grandmaster who also has a Twitch channel, said that well, uh, the more um, to call this. said something to that if something to the effect that the um, the dumber it is the more popular it becomes right something to that effect I agree with him because it started to become uh, it started to become a fact of life all right that is scary all right that is scarier than any horror anime Scarier than any horror than any horror movie I've ever watched. Why? Because <clears throat> being dumb, whether we like it or not, is easy. Being smart takes a lot of work. You know, if you're a content creator like me, you should not go the dumb route. Alright? Because everybody else is doing it these days everybody else so reddit here's my uh, power tip for you if you want to build a brand you would rather play dumb than be dumb because what well, if you play dumb that means you're learning something you're learning something along the way but if you but if you're being dumb, if you really are dumb, all right, success will only last probably 15 minutes at the most for you. Because, well, everybody else is doing it. So, you'll be lucky if you get your 15 minutes of fame. So, again, Reddit, <clears throat> it is better to play dumb than to be Dumb. I just went over YouTube and uh, well, I've seen a lot of uh, videos. Here's my say on the matter, Reddit. It's pure silliness. Alright? It's pure silliness. If you would take it from a... Um, you would take it from a uh, stream of consciousness, law of attraction standpoint, both of them both parties are wrong both parties made a mistake all right <clears throat> i'll explain fedmeister all right fedmeister has been kicked out of the uh, out of the same streaming house pokemon and uh, he uh, he's with he's unstable with uh, he's unstable with pokemon all right Due to inappropriate actions against other female members of that house. Okay. He was kicked out. Now, Pokimane on the other hand, um, I don't know why, why she did it, but she was leading on Fedmeister. Okay. Now, uh, into believing that they, they're onto something, they're, on, they're in a relationship, they're, uh, they're somewhat getting into a relationship together. Which is also wrong, okay? Whether you're uh, whether you're male, female, LGBT or whatever, you do not lead a person on like that, All right? Right off the bat, tell that person you're just friends. Okay? Now, in the case of Fedmeister, well, he probably got what he deserved, and he is, well, and through that expose of his, he. That expose he leaked out, he's trying to change for the better. All good for him, but uh, well, he's trying to be accountable for his own actions, which is uh, which is really good. Pokemon, on the other hand, is still trying to make excuses, still trying to um, come up with some some uh, some uh, new story about this matter. You know what? Like I said before, Reddit, both made a mistake. Okay. Now, I don't know why, why all this drama is blowing up on YouTube right now. 
It shouldn't. It fucking shouldn't. It is detrimental to um, what you call this to the growth of current content creators. It is also detrimental to the introduction of new content creators. Instead of um, what you call this, instead of egging other people on to become content creators through this controversy that's happening on YouTube. You're driving them away. Okay? This controversy is driving those people away. So again, Reddit, when it comes to this kind of a controversy, both made a mistake. I just saw this um <clears throat> this meme from uh, from something that Warren Buffett said. And well, he's right on that. Most uh, skills these days, well, most most professions these days don't even don't require talent, right? Much less a college diploma. To continuously think that you still need a college diploma just to um, just to be successful at anything in this day of age, you're still living in the in, you're still living in. Uh, the industrial age okay that is still industrial age thinking i don't know why mainstream media and most families are still insisting uh, that their kids should have a college degree in order to be successful that idea has been obsolete since 1989 all right when when the berlin wall came down okay when basically the when basically communism fell right it only takes being coachable and having a good work ethic to to be successful at anything right Warren Buffett's, the Warren Buffett meme actually says it all. I don't even have to explain it through this diary's entry. If you have those nine mentioned by, uh, mentioned by, mentioned by Mr. Buffett, you, you will have a good, you will have a good chance of having a successful and charmed life. All right. Follow those nine LinkedIn. Follow those nine. If you want to well if you want to experience any kind of success I just came across this uh, meme by Gary Vaynerchuk over at LinkedIn and I'm going to explain I'm going to um, somewhat call this expand on that right here on Instagram he says there well I think you've seen the meme. I think you've seen that meme already. Well, people always um, go for go for being perfect, go for that perfect uh, that perfect stream, that perfect post, that perfect video, perfect plan, perfect um, job. You know. From my point of view, perfectionism is also laziness. Right? You always you would always dwell in the fact that you want uh, something to be perfect first before actually uh, putting it into action. You want it to be you basically want a relationship to be perfect before you could um, before you could uh, ask the guy or girl out on a date or even ask her ask him or her to marry you <sighs> that is fucking laziness nothing gets done even in the face of perfectionism all right perfectionism is um, is a hindrance to success actually is a hindrance it's also a hindrance to happiness if you would put it in Gary V's mindset. Being a perfectionist, well, 
it actually doesn't help anybody. If you want something to work, you need to see it as it happens. Then make the adjustments. You feel me, Instagram? Here's a parting shot for you, Instagram. Perfectionism is also laziness. I just uh, recently uh, saw this uh, Instagram post by Sir Elton John. And, well, wow, I thought, wow. <clears throat> Even up to now, uh, one of my musical idols is still relevant. Even in this day of age. It just goes, well, just goes to show you TikTok. Success online knows no age. All right? It doesn't matter if you're, if you're 5, 25, 55, 65, or even as, or even as old as Sir Elton himself. Right. If you are more than willing to put in the hours, put in whatever talents you have, put in whatever means necessary to be a success both either online, offline, or both, guess what? You are going, you are going to get the success that you want. For Sir Elton John to be successful both offline and on Spotify decades later, means something online success okay online success for him means well he's a rock and roll hall of famer he already has an established brand that that is that, that stands the test of time all right he's got worthy causes so but you don't need to be sir you don't need to be like sir elton john to uh to be successful online or much less on Spotify. All right. Do not compare your chapter one to his chapter. Chapter fifty. <laughs> chapter. You know, being being in the business for fifty years, right? Chapter fifty. Right. But if you're more than willing to put your time, your effort, and your talents, bunch them all up, and put in the hours. You may surpass Sir Elton John on Spotify. All right? It's a wild goal, but hey, it's better to have a goal than to have no goal. You get me, TikTok? So again, here's my power tip for you, TikTok. Online success knows no age. I'm about halfway through my uh, my 24-hour stream tonight, and I'm quite satisfied with uh, what I've set up. <laughs> Let me show it to you. I don't know if you can uh, if you can see that. <clears throat> there's my there's my extension camera. Okay, if you noticed it, that's my uh, that's my go-to cell phone. This is, yeah, there's the laptop. As you can see, the camera light is off. So, I am now able to uh, record the reviews from the laptop camera. I can actually deny, have the laptop deny access to OBS. Alright. And I'm quite satisfied right now with uh, what I've done here. Maybe a little tedious, but hey, sometimes you, uh, sometimes you got to initiate that change in order to see the change. <clears throat> I've been dabbling with the idea of uh, this since I can't afford to, uh, I can't afford to have an have uh, have a real streaming setup, okay? Because I stream from my bed. Everybody, everyone on Twitch knows that. Okay, I stream from my bed. I actually do my I actually do my business on bed. All right. 
and as you've seen, as you've seen in uh, in one of my previous diaries entries, all right. No, what am I getting at here, Twitch? Simple. Like I said a while ago, you have to initiate before you could see change. All right. These days, well, I don't know why, why people these days are still waiting for change. They're either waiting or complaining. They, they're complaining that uh, no change is happening. Well, I got some sad news for all those who are complaining or still, they're still playing the waiting game for change. It's not going to come unless you do something about it. All right. But more often than not, if someone starts the change, the change will happen. All right. This this has been proven all throughout his all throughout human history. All right? Even even during ancient times, Romulus and Remus founded Rome because, well, they weren't um, they weren't satisfied with how they're living, with their standard of living. Remember, they were raised by a she wolf. All right. Um, Alexander Graham Bell invented the telephone because, well, he found that. Letters and letters and telegraphy, the telegram, they're too slow for him. Hence the invention of the telephone. All right. Those who initiated change made change certain. All right. Those who initiate change, they, um, they made the world a better place right now. So power tip for you, Twitch. You have to initiate to see change.